What's up guys, it's Latoya, and today we're gonna be talking about this little sewing machine that I found on Walmart.com. So I was just looking for a sewing machine, something to just start off with, small, and this is pretty much what I found here. <laughs> it's called the Inspiration 700 watt desktop sewing machine. It's a, uh, it's like it's set, it says so and so desktop sewing machine. So today I have opened it, but that's all I've done, and just put it back in there. But I actually want to open it with y'all today, and you know, show y'all what's in the box. There's one thing, like I said, I already took it out, but it does come with the foot pedal. Just so y'all know, it does come with a foot pedal. This is the adapter that you plug into the wall and you plug into the sewing machine to make it work. This is like, uh, like I guess what the sewing kit uh, like includes, like uh, you know, the measuring tape, the normal stuff you'd get. This is what it all has in there. It includes 10 metal bobbins, 10 spools of thread, two needle threaders, one seam ripper, one measuring tape, two sewing machine needles. Other things that includes is two thread pulls, two metal bobbins, one replacement needle, one buttonhole presser foot, one needle threader, one foot pedal, and one AC adapter, which I have already showed y'all. Okay. This is what it looks like, and it also comes with the instruction manual, and it comes with, uh, I guess it's talking about the limited warranty to the original purchaser, so I guess if you give it to someone else, it wouldn't work for that person, or if you sell it or something. Okay, so let's take these off. One cool thing I see is that it does have a handle so it's easy to carry around. And it also comes with this stuff. I guess that was kind of like the additional things. Not sure. Y'all, I really don't know anything about sewing machines at all. Never sewed on a machine in my life, so yeah. So it's pretty much telling what all this stuff is. This is a thread tension dial. The thread take up lever is in there. Also, we have the thread cutter here or in this area. <laughs> we have the reverse lever. We have the pressure foot right here. We have the needle plate back here. There is a removable, come down some more. A removable extension bed here we have the bobbin winding stopper right here right here we have the power on and off and speed control switch this is the pattern selector dial right here we have the pressure foot release lever or lever whatever the needle is here and it's very sharp Right here is the needle clamp and screw. We have the pressure bar in here. We got the pressure foot holder here. Right here we have the pressure foot screw. Under here we have the feed dogs. And right here we have the bobbin cover plate. And right here we have the bobbin cover release plate. And then we're going to turn around to the back side. Right here we have the spool pin. Right here is the bobbin, the bobbin wander. We have the carry handle that I had already showed y'all. Right here is the hand wheel. This right here is the foot controller input. This is a power cord socket, so that would be what the AC adapter would go into. And right here we also have the presser foot lifter. Under here we have the light switch and built-in sewing light. I'm going to show that to y'all in just a minute. Up here we have the face plate. This is a thread pull. This is the bobbin under here. 
So what I'm gonna do is turn it on to show y'all what it looks like. So y'all, this is the uh, adapter and we're gonna plug in right here in that spot I was telling y'all about. And then I'm gonna plug it up. This is the home switch. Um, y'all, I really have no idea what it's doing. <laughs> Let's see if we can find that uh, light. I don't know if y'all can see that, but yeah, y'all can. As it's doing whatever it's doing, it does light up. I don't want to stick my hand out of there because like I said, I don't know what I'm doing. I just bought it because I wanted to try it out. And let's see it looks like on high. Okay. So if you want to do it higher, I guess that's how you do it. I have no idea, y'all. Let's slow that down some. I honestly don't know what this thing is doing. But I'm just showing y'all some things. Oh, like how you, when you turn on and stuff. And obviously it's going pretty crazy. So, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna reach back on here and turn this off. Cause this is like crazy, dude. I, is mine broke or something? Because I don't even think it's supposed to be, is it supposed to be doing all that? Cause I don't even live. Okay y'all, so that's what the inspiration 700 the so and so inspiration 700 looks like um i really need to figure out and get to know how this thing works because honestly you know i don't i guess if you want to like hand do it like this you can it came with this little piece right here in there so i don't know what they were doing there but yeah that's what it looks like and when i get to find out how to use it I'll come back at y'all, okay? So really what I'm doing is just unboxing. And that's what it looks like, guys. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button to see more. And also, don't forget to comment below and ask questions or tell me more about this thing because that would be great. Also, don't forget to like this video if you like it. And thanks so much for watching. See y'all in the next video. Bye. <laughs>